channel. My name is Ayushi Badeka, and in today's video, we are doing a what's in my bag along with a bag review. I got this bag last month while I was traveling, like before I was traveling, because I wanted a travel bag, and that was an excuse to buy this because I had my eyes on these for a very long time. Like this bag, I had my eyes on them for a very long time. and i loved everything about it i loved the color in fact actually i fell in love with the color the most so yeah i bought this bag and let's dive into what's in it also if i didn't mention earlier we are doing a giveaway every month so this is the first giveaway of may and in fact no this is not the first giveaway of the year but the second giveaway of the year and uh, after this month we're starting one giveaway every month and this month's giveaway is super exciting so stay tuned till the end to see what is what i'm giving away okay so i'm not going to run around the bush anymore and i'm going to show you this bag right here i got the mark jacobs tote bag this is what it looks like it is extremely heavy because i have my entire world in this and this is the medium size bag of in the color cement and honestly when i was buying this bag uh, in fact i caught my like this bag caught my eye when i saw this color only like there were two particular colors this and the denim one that i loved since the beginning i saw it on social media and i loved it so much that I wanted to get this for a very long time and I finally got it. So I got it in the size medium. I was contemplating to get the large size also because I thought medium might not fit a lot of stuff because I was buying buying this bag for the traveling purposes only. Uh, not only but like you know for, for traveling purposes mainly. And uh, when I saw reviews online I realized that the big one is huge like it's really big and I don't need a big a tote bag that big there are three sizes in this bag one is a mini one is a medium and one is a large the mini is extremely small uh, but it comes in the same shape and the large one is extremely big so i got this one right here and this fits in a lot you are going to be surprised to see everything that is in it okay so starting off with what's in my bag first is uh, is this travel essentials pouch and i literally have a lot in this right now i have uh, makeup removing wipes normal wipes makeup removing wipes like normal uh, hand wipes or uh, towel like it's a normal napkin which has my initials on it let me find it yeah which has my cute little initials on it and because that's why i love this one a lot i carry this all the everywhere one sunscreen of uh, on the days i'm not wearing makeup and i have to you know reapply my sunscreen so this one this one's from dot and key i love love this sunscreen i have one more of this in the orange color tube i don't know this one is the watermelon cooling sunscreen and the orange one is water based but with that sunscreen i'm experiencing a little bit of peeling but this one works wonders so you should totally check this out then i have a comb yeah i have a comb i have a little perfume i have my roll on right here sorry i don't know why it's not focusing yeah i have my roll on right here and yes i have my lenses but i don't wear them often so yeah this is what is in this pouch now let's move on to the other section I have this little makeup pouch right here. It's a cute color. It's velvet, and I got this in PR from Bobbi Brown. So I've been making the most of it. So what's in it? I have this compact from. This is dirty though. I'm gonna clean it. Yeah, I have this compact from uh, Bobbi Brown again. It's in the shade Warm Natural 4.5. I really really like this. I really like this. Sorry, yeah. Oops. It's a very good compact powder. It uh, you know, if you're not even wearing makeup, you can just put a little bit of you know, a little bit of this on your face and you're good to go. Like it just you just start look more looking more presentable. So, that's what I have. 
then i have this lip cheek lip and cheek tint just in case if i need it i have my lip balm right here i have a little blush from la girl it's the cream blush that they have i bought it after my trip cuz one of my friend was using it and i used her blush every single day i loved it it was so pigmented it's so creamy i'm just going to show you a little swatch of this you don't have to take a lot you just have to take a little bit yeah this is also a lot if you know when you see it after sorry after you see how it looks what's wrong with my english why can't i speak correctly so this is also a lot when i blend it you'll be able to see so yeah do you see that the pigment is insane it's it, it's literally insane and i love love it i have two of these new lipsticks this lipstick is i have three of these this one's from pack sorry i don't know yeah this one's from pack it's in the shade 16 slay queen and it's my favorite nude shade it is a very very pretty nude and it looks really nice on my skin tone so in case if your skin tone is anything like mine check it out i really love it and um, yeah i have this band from from birkenstock which i don't wear i just have it so this is what was in my makeup pouch even after this there is literally so much space inside my bag right now i have one mini tripod uh, this doesn't extend a lot this extends only this much now after that i have my sunglasses right here my sunglasses are i, I love these i love this i i these sunglasses i had my eyes on these for the longest longest time uh, i think i uh, i saw it in the store i loved it but i was not able to justify the price for it this is for 11000 and i was not able to justify the price so i just skipped it then uh, during i think gangubai's trailer then all of that alia bhat was wearing it and i and i flipped i was like i really need it now and after that also i I literally pushed this purchase for a while but I finally got it I think a couple of months ago and I'm in love. Now is my medicine pouch. I don't carry this pouch on a daily basis. If I'm carrying this throughout the day then I don't carry it but if I'm traveling with this bag then this is a medicine pouch that I totally carry. I always have this in my cupboard. I just pick it up and put it in my bag. This has a lot. This has literally every medicine I would need. It has a wigs. It has Q-tips. It has band-aids. It has uh, medicines from a uh, crocin to painkillers to like loose motion. Literally, you name it, and I have it because I am a little freak like that. I get very paranoid, so I need medicines on the go all the time. So this is what I have, and this is also pretty. you know like bulky so this bag literally fits a lot now of course i have my airpods and if you are thinking that i would not have space this bag also along with all of this fits my laptop in it um i have my laptop and my notepad like notebook inside everything is and you know like everything is so heavy but the thing is that there's still space to put more stuff so in case if you're ready to like hold and carry weight on your hands then literally you can fill in everything in this bag uh, for a daily use or for travel purposes whatever and uh, that was all that was there in my this section of the bag now i'll show you what's in this compartment little compartment that comes with this bag i have my card holder with my cards and my cash in it so this is what i have after that i have one more perfume and this is my current favorite perfume from burberry is it's burberry her i have a big size of this and like the large size of this and i have this travel size also i have a lotion also in this fragrance and i love it so that's what is that's what's there i have my home keys and i think that's about it 
Okay, so now that we're done with what's in my bag, I am gonna show you what this bag looks like and do a mini review. Okay, so like I mentioned, this bag is in the color cement and if you want to get a size reference of how big it is, it is bigger than my face, like it's, it's still here, this is what, this is the size of the bag. It comes with this, it's pretty cool though. This particular section has a magnet here, so every time, you know, like a lot of their bags, you know, which have zip in it, this this thing just keeps hanging. So here, when you just put it over here, the magnet sticks. The magnet sticks and this does not move around a lot and I think it's pretty convenient uh, to have such a feature in your bag. So that's about that. It comes with a long zip which is also adjustable. Yeah, I don't know why it's not focusing. Yeah, so this this is adjustable. It comes with a long uh, sling or chain along with that. It comes with these two top handles also. But my only complaint with this bag is, the only complaint is that this top handle, if it was bigger, it I could, you know, like hold it here on my arms. But right now I can't have to hold it on my elbows only. And sometimes if you have so much stuff in your bag it gets pretty heavy and your hand will start hurting so that's the only complaint so uh, if you go for the Marc Jacobs uh, you know the tote bag in the size mini that size is also this and the medium size is also this whereas the large one has a really big handle so you can you know like put it on your arms or, or on your elbows or on your arms that's the only complaint I have also speaking about the leather it, it has a soft leather but it's not a leather that would wear, oh, is what I think. It is soft leather, it's not hard leather, but uh, I don't see this bag wearing. But yeah, it does crease. It creases a lot, if you can see on this side. This bag does crease because it's soft leather and you have to take care of it. Or else, uh, yeah, your bag will start looking, you know, like worn out soon. So they have their branding also over here. Yeah, they have their branding right here and this is again you know like movable so that your bag will not rotate this will keep moving on in its own in case you want to like shift and if there's movement or, or you know while you're carrying your bag so that's about that this is pretty long this this chain sorry chain slash sling uh, belt is pretty long you can like keep it near your waist or it, it can go down up until your leg also so yes that's about that now let me show you what's inside and this is what the bag looks like from the inside and the lower part of the bag is canvas whereas the sides are leather it's a good thing to have your base as canvas because if you're keeping so many things it will not uh, you know leave a dent in your bag on the inside which is good which is what i think is good so this was about the mark jacob stored bag in the size medium shade cement and i officially love it along with the bag you also get a dust bag which is cooler i love the dust bag also yeah this is what the dust bag looks like i love the entire mark jacobs you know branding done all over the bag and it looks pretty cool sorry that was my dog uh it looks pretty cool so i keep my i store my bag in this dust bag every single day okay so that was about the what's in my bag and a little mini review of the Marc Jacobs tote bag and now let's speak about the giveaway that we all have been waiting for since the beginning okay so i am giving away this hamper from pure essence it's their pink guava range it has three things i'm just gonna show it to you yes it has three things one is their pomegranate face wash the second is the pink guava day cream and the third thing is the pink guava face scrub so these are the three things that i'm giving away in this hamper it also has a cute little note uh, which explains how to use it so yes this is what we're giving away for this month so in case you want to participate 
all the details are mentioned in the description box below and if you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and follow the rules for the giveaway and i'll see you next time bye also i forgot to mention please leave recommendations of what you would like to see on my channel on youtube in the comment section below and i will make sure to do it so see you next time bye